Okay, so if you found this video, you're probably looking for how to middle mouse button click to auto scroll in Adobe Reader and you realize that it doesn't work. Um, maybe on a website, you, you've opened a PDF and you've middle clicked and you've scrolled and it can go hands free, but in Adobe Reader, it doesn't seem to work. That's what I was struggling with. So thank you, University of Kent, that showed me the hotkey in Adobe Reader. Control Shift H, and this is actually really handy. I'll show you why. So here we are, Adobe Reader, and notice that if I'm clicking the middle mouse button, um, it's not going to auto-scroll for me. Or I, I can click and hold, but I can't let it go. So here's what you're looking for. The hotkey is Control-Shift-H. I'm guessing on a Mac that's Command-Shift-H. So as soon as I do that, it's scrolling on its own. Control-Shift-H again to stop it. And what you can do is click on your right up down arrows on your keyboard to make it go faster or slower. You see here, so the further I click on the down arrows, the faster it goes. If I click up, it slows down. And if I go above the stop point, it actually starts going backwards. Okay, so the reason this is so handy for me is that I can have it scrolling extremely slowly and then I can alt tab over to my note taking program and I can uh, type in some things or paste in, in some things and then I can alt tab back and it's still there and it's slow enough that I can tab away, uh, type, type out some stuff, tab back, and obviously then if you're reading you can press the down arrow a few times, read faster and then slow down, or even stop it. Uh, and one, one more thing to note is that it will stop when you select text, so it's rolling, you're like, oh, I want this part nevertheless, so you just click that and then it will stop it. You can copy and paste it, uh, paste it in your note-taking program and then tab back. Control Shift H Adobe Reader. I hope that's helpful. Hmm. Hmm.